And I'm back again. Yeah, after another long hiatus. Yeah, but yeah, not not much has happened since I last uploaded the video. Yeah, just just little changes. Uh, like like I, I am still working at the no, I guess it's not a ski resort right now, but the mountain resort. Uh, but I, I was working four days a week, uh, not nine hours a day, but now they've, they cut back to only being open Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And now they're, now after Labor Day, they're, they're uh, only open on weekends, Saturday and Sunday, uh, and until 5 p.m. So now I'm only working two days a week, seven hours each day. So yeah, yeah, so I have a lot of time on my hands right now, and I'm, I've, I've been trying to do other things was that time. Uh, and yeah, yeah, I've been slowly doing more outside the house. I, I did actually meet up with a friend outside. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, she texted me, she said, well, she, she texted me asking me if, uh, I'd be real willing to hang out, but and I, I said yes, but if we could hang out outside, because, uh, yeah, I'm still kind of weary, I think is the right word, about COVID-19. Even though it has gotten a lot better, you know, you know, we're still in a pandemic right now. Yeah, things aren't back to normal just yet. Yeah, so I, like, asked her to meet outside. So yeah, I asked her to meet outside. Just because I think that's, cause it, it's better than inside because there's a lot more ventilation and air circulation outside uh, and we, we both did wear masks you know yeah face masks on <laughs> so yeah so yeah it was just like being at work being outside and wearing wearing face masks so yeah that's that's when I feel safest being around other people, uh, being outside, yeah, but I'm, I'm still not ready to, like, go inside, uh, except for, like, grocery shopping or, or other, buy, or buying other stuff that I need, so, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm like really not ready just to be inside a restaurant, sitting down and eating a meal, or uh, or being in a movie theater and watching a movie for two hours or more. Uh, uh, unless I'm by myself. Yeah. But yeah, but is there, there's like other people around inside. Then I'm still nervous. Yeah, 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 but I'm just slowly getting, I'm slowly becoming less on edge, I would say. 
but still probably won't be back to you know my normal state uh, until there's a vaccine which probably won't be until spring 2021 at the earliest I did go and get a flu shot yeah yeah uh, yeah I think they just became available last week yeah yeah and when I heard they were available I went and got mine just because it might get bad again in the winter when flu season hits and a pandemic so so yeah at least flu shot will help me against the flu then all I have to worry about is COVID-19 but yeah but yeah it's like like I said I'm constantly feeling on edge and yeah I'm just dealing with my anxiety not just with COVID but also with uh my life in general because uh uh, I, I, I just turned 30 in August. Yeah. And, and I'm just like now wondering what's going to happen with the rest of my life or what I'm going to do. Because even, even though I, I like my job working at the mountain resort it, there yeah it's easy it's an easy job and everyone's chill it, it's just not something I want to do for the rest of my life it, uh, and uh, I'll, I'll probably just go back there in the winter uh, because right now I think that's my only option uh, for work uh, I, I am looking into getting another job uh, for right, right now just because I, I have five days off so yeah it would be a good time to to have like another part-time job Uh, but yeah yeah and like before the whole pandemic I, I think I mentioned that I was thinking about going back to school uh, but yeah now that's not gonna happen uh, uh, anytime soon I mean I know, I know they have online classes but yeah but I just still want to like figure out what I want to go back to school for what I really want to do uh, and yeah still not exactly sure about that and oh and yeah and then there's all the, the like the film jobs like the production assistant jobs I was doing but I wouldn't feel comfortable doing them now. Uh, could, could, because a, a lot of times being a production assistant RPA here, uh, I've personally been like like a, a, a driver, and I've driven people from different locations and also to the airport uh, and, and pick them up from the airport so I, I don't want to do that now with COVID yeah just have strangers in my car less than six feet away from me uh, even if we're all wearing masks and we got the windows rolled down all the way it's just 
yeah, it just doesn't sit well with me. So, yeah, yeah, I, I don't want to do that. And, and I'm sure there would be, sure I would have to do that again if I were to do a, another PA gig. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm just, I don't know, all tied up in knots. <laughs> sure, that's, yeah, let's go with that. That sounds like it describes my feelings. But yeah, so, yeah, but since I have so much time on my hands now, maybe now I'll get back into vlogging, but I'll have to think of stuff to talk about, <laughs> but although there are some ideas for videos that I did have, and, the, and the, yeah, now would be the time do it so yeah yeah I think I should do it should do those ideas and yeah so hope hopefully soon there'll be more videos coming and not, not just vlogs like these oh and also uh, it, it's been so smoky around me because of all the forest fires on the west coast and all the smoke travels. Uh, so yeah, and I, I think the smoke has been affecting me because I've been having like sinus pressure in my face. And that's not one of the signs of or signs or symptoms of COVID. So, yeah, pretty sure smoke has been affecting me. So, there's another thing that uh, gets me all tied up in knots. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, anyway, that's going to be it for this kind of rambling vlog. But, Hey, uh, at least I made one. So until next video, goodbye. Yeah, that. I don't know you. Spam call.